Converting Verilog to a digital circuit is actually pretty straightforward because Verilog is just a textual representation for a digital circuit. And so there's going to be one gate in our output circuit for each of the gates specified in the Verilog. And I'm going to, in this case, go from bottom to top because the NOT gate's only input is um, one of my input literals. And so I'm going to instantiate an inverter also known as a NOT gate, and its output is going to be this W99 signal. With that done, I can now instantiate the AND gate. The AND gate's output is the output of our whole circuit, and its three inputs are X, Y, and W99. And so there is our circuit.